One, two, one, two. <laughs> Say no more. Wayne, what up? Chef, what up? Hey! Uh, rock, <laughs> rock, <laughs> rock. Hey, <laughs> hey. Let's see. Chef, uh, look. I know I gotta set the tone and watch them follow suit It's all about the pressure now and more ways to get the loot A new year, a new us, we gotta elevate Foot on the gas, I ain't lit enough till we all straight It's gonna be a domino effect when we all locked in I was being supposed to be on, but I was out club hopping The city is everything This nigga got a PlayStation 2, an Xbox, a PlayStation 4, a PlayStation 5, a Nintendo Wii, a motherfucking... Nintendo 64, if I didn't say that already, a motherfucking, I don't even know what that shit, a, a Super Nintendo. All right, we ready. We all, yo, yo, yo. 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 I'm back in. Yo. Hello. It's your boy, Wayne. It's your boy, K of the Prophet. Yo, let me do the intro. Yo, y'all niggas, man. Y'all niggas, yo. Hey, yo, this the, hey, yo, we, we keeping this shit, too. We keeping this shit, too. I, I know you didn't. I'm not looking at you right now, nigga. This nigga, worry, I will. This nigga said I'm innocent. Yo, man, this nigga, yo, it, it, it's okay. These is my boys. These are my brothers. They not, you know what I'm saying? I, we're, I, we're not paid professionals. Let me, let, let me finish talking, bro. Stop doing it. You're doing it again. You're doing it again. God fucking damn. These are my brothers. You know what I'm saying? They not really, you know, they not already, they not really used to, uh, you know, sitting down and not knowing when to talk and knowing when to chime in. You know what I mean? So we gonna get to it. You know what I mean? But uh, we back in, man. You know what I mean? I had a beautiful uh little trip, man. I was in the the good state of Dallas. I mean, good state of Texas was in the city of Dallas. You know what I mean? Shout out to them, man. You know what I mean? Mad big booties, you know what I mean? I couldn't really do nothing, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I was Ooh. chilling, you know what I mean? Like, even my girl, she appreciated, she appreciated, you know what I mean, the scenery. So, you know what I mean? It was real dope. Everything was good, man. But we back in town, man. We back in town, though, man. It was crazy. As I was flying in, man, I had my uh, AirPods in. I was listening to uh, to uh, the new Dave East. Dave East and uh, 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 Uncle Murder, they dropped a couple tracks and shit. A white guy taps me. He said, yo, sir, can you turn that shit down? I took my AirPods out, looked that man dead in the eye, and said, I can't. <laughs> Whoa. It was the best feeling ever, yo. But no, nah, man, we back in the building, man. I'm sitting here, man. I got my boy to the left, man. My boy Juice in the building, man. What's going on? What's going on with y'all, man? To my right, man. My first right, I got my boy Kev the Prophet in the building. What's going on? What's going on, man? Chillin', chillin'. Chillin'. To the far, far right, I got motherfucking Rico 600. He said a six, baby. Oh, uh, look, that nigga tried to come in smooth. Fuck out of here, nigga. Where was this rowdy, rowdy shit at? Just please this nigga, it, this nigga tried six, to. Baby. This nigga's crazy. He's a, he's a, he's a, that, that was good. I give you that. That was good, man. How was y'all weekend, man? Everything was good. Y'all niggas had fun. Everything, you know what I mean? Just keep it cordial. Was everything good? I had an amazing weekend, bro. That's what's up. How about you? Hey, man. Everything was everything. We'll just say that. How about you? I popped bottles this weekend. Yeah, oh, shout out to you. And watched the. Uh, the Timberwolves. That's what's up, man. I viewed Rico live at the Target Center. It was beautiful. Now, that's what's up. No, that's what's up, beautiful. man. The weekend was good, man, because it's like coming in, you know what I mean? Like, we still, like, kind of coming to transition into that springtime. Right now, I feel like summer. You know what I mean? So, so it's like, it's like, it's like, what the fuck is really going on? You know what I mean? It was 90 degrees today. Man, who you telling, bro? Sticky who you telling? Boy. It felt like, nigga, it felt like we was in Do the Right Thing. If you seen the movie, you know what I mean? <laughs> You know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, speaking of do the right thing and hot tempers and shit, man. <laughs> How y'all feel about the uh, the Timberwolves game, man? Like, because, you know, first off, I also want to say, man, Timberwolves was playing on Sunday, man. It was a heated game. We needed that game. You know what I mean? It's a real, real, real fierce game. And uh, during the timeout, Rudy Gobert decides to punch Kevin, you know what I mean, Kyle Anderson. Kyle Anderson. They say Kyle Anderson was calling him a bitch multiple times. But, you know, what I would say to that is, what, was he lying? Now, how did how, how y'all kind of feel about that? What was y'all reaction when y'all first saw that? I feel like light skinned niggas was just being light skinned, and if they would have played some Drake, everybody would have kumbaya, and this shit would have been cool. 
<laughs> Drake would have saved the day. Drake would have saved the day. They could have just played mm-hmm. some Drakes, played some passion fruit, or 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 you some know, some, <laughs> some some smooth Drake. You know, some 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 some. Who do you think you are? And everything would have been, you know, would have been good, man. No, no. Uh, I, I, I think I think that it just fucked up the team chemistry. That's why they came in there the way they did and struggled against the Lakers, man. Like. They the timber puppies, man. They got a young squad. That, well, well, that's the next game. We're talking about the game on that happened on Sunday when he punched them. Yeah, all oh, the game yeah, on Sunday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll, yeah we'll get on that Lakers shit. But yeah. it still, it still fucked up the team chemistry though. It definitely did. You know what I'm saying? Like, why is y'all fighting? This ain't Draymond and Jordan Poole. Y'all really? Ain't. I was drunk because I, I didn't even see that. Y'all not on that level. Yeah, yeah, I was there. Yeah, he sucked. Yeah, I was. Yeah, all the games. Speaking of, there's a bunch of beta males competing for supremacy. That's what it was. <laughs> Rude called Rudy a bitch or whatever, right? And he did that preschool jab and barely nicked the dude. And Tori and Prince, the realest in the room, was finna beat both of them up. And, and that was then a Frenchman punch. And Dum Dum decides, I'm gonna go punch the wall. <laughs> like, like we're in middle school on our way to ISS at Ramsey. I'm gonna hit this wall as hard as I can. You're an idiot. Yeah, the whole thing. Fucking up the church's money. Yeah, man. The whole fun. church. Yeah, it's funny, man. Like you said, though, Kev, the whole thing was kind of fucked up because it fucked up the whole team chemistry. And I saw a couple of you little bozo, bozo, bozo. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna cuss yet. I, I gotta wait. Yeah. Yep. Give me, give me, get past that. That amen mark. I'll, I'll get to that. A lot of you dudes that sitting there talking about, oh yeah, that was good. We needed that. We needed that. No, you know what we needed? We needed him last night. We needed that nigga last night. Boom. Boom. Where was you at, Rudy? Where were you at? Definitely need Eat popcorn. Now let's go back on that. We watched the game last night. Lakers versus Timberwolves. Very, very close game. Very, it was so close that if we would have had two of them, I feel like we would have won by 15. Can I say something? That's like the craziest thing. That live by the three, die by the three mentality ain't going to get us nowhere. You talking about Carl? Yes. They got to get rid of that <laughs> nigga, man. In the room. They yeah, got to get rid of that He's a shooting man. guard. Hey, D- and, dog. We watched the game last night, bro. Me and Wayne said it in the first two minutes of the game at least six times. Bro, go down low. Get in the paint. You started at the five. My man's didn't go in the paint, but maybe one possession out of the whole game, including OT. For when he, he was go, in. He don't go in the paint. He lives at the three line. He's a bozo. He lives bro. at the three line. He don't He's, never go in the paint. Never. He said he the best three point shooting big man. Yeah. And that's he a lie. did get the three. He did win the three point contest. But guess what though? But that ain't the real game. Time out, time out. You know you would take Dirk over him. Any day to win. <laughs> that, so we're just going to end Any that right there. Yeah, he's not the best. He's not no. the best. Yeah, he's not no. the best, man. And that whole situation, it kind of just shows, man, like a lot of people in Minnesota, we we praise me- mediocrity, like yeah. the, the mediocre Preach. shit, where it's like, bro, we shouldn't be praising this shit, man. Like, nah, now we got to deal with who whoever wins. Brandon Ingram, who just dropped 40 on us, or this nigga, Chai, who's uh, averaging literally 30. Right. Come on, man, pick your poison. I don't want none of them niggas, though. Come on, pause. But I bro, just pray like, whole bear come back. No, nah, he should be back. He should be pants, back. You know he should saying? be back on Friday. We play Friday. No, no I'm saying he come back with with a. Sense Are you of going man, to bro. that game? On Friday? Yeah. Hell no, hey. I'm not going to no more games. Oh okay. Because them niggas be fucking taxing for them, bro. But realistically, yeah, okay. I might, I might, I might be at the game on Friday. Right. Realistically though, where is the coach? When, when the coach gonna step in and tell Towns stop taking them shots, bro? Yo, that coach is a replacement guy. Like, what are you doing? He's the substitute teacher that never left. Yeah, that's facts. But it gotta come like, to a point. We where like this nigga, this like we like line. this nigga, but he really ain't. He really can't teach us shit. But we like him because he brings snacks. We do all that. <laughs> I'm good. Snacks. You know what I mean? He brings snacks. He good on that. That's kind of how that nigga's built. Because Finch don't know what the fuck he be doing as Bro. far as clock management, as far as uh, player substitution management, player man, all that. None of that. Especially when it's crunch time. And last night, he should have told Ant, stop jacking them shots. I, I was, I, yeah, I wouldn't he go. Was one for like 14 going into fourth and OT. He got some bum ass layups, but he missed like six threes and turned the ball over how many times? He was over here the first two minutes of the game. Wayne was like, he don't need to handle the ball. He don't need to handle the ball. I don't know if that nigga Ant Man was hurt or what was going on. But uh, mm-hmm. that nigga, that nigga didn't need none of that, man. But you know, we got to play on Friday, so we gonna just, you know, what I mean, look forward towards that, man. We are gonna look towards for that, man. So uh, games switching shit up, man. I kind of wanna, I'm gonna jump ahead with this one, so I'm going out of order. Uh, the Lori Vallow trial, man. Lori Vallow, man. 
that's the uh the uh the woman that was involved in an Idaho in an Idaho murder with her kids and uh, her brother, her husband, all that shit's involved. Her trial just started. Uh, they showed the uh, pictures of uh, the remains of her children, according you know what I mean to uh, people that was in the courtroom. The jurors were so disgusted they tried to hey ask for recess for the rest of the day. The judge said, "Nah, sit your ass down, sit your ass down." <laughs> They told them to sit their ass down because it was time for them to learn. And what they learned was uh, they're not playing with this white woman. <laughs> As they shouldn't, though, bro. She killed her own kids. Then I think the husband that she remarried or whatever, the second husband, yeah. then they like had something to do with her wife getting killed or his wife getting killed? His wife his got ex-wife, killed. His ex-wife. His, his ex-wife. Well, it was, it was ex-wife once she was dead. You yeah. Know what I'm right. <laughs> so, okay, so that's the rules. If a white person kill a lot of white people, then the other white people are not going to like them. Because if she just would have killed one person, it would have it, it probably been okay. Shit, look at Stephen right. Avery, that nigga uh, from Making a Murderer, or the Netflix joint. Mm-hmm. That's the shit that fucking popped Netflix off low key with these originals. <laughs> Got them did. millions. That why, yeah. I guess you're right. Well, that logic her, is, is the She thing. thought her kids were zombies or whatever, bro. Was That's they on some they type of drugs? Describing it. it was some uh, religious. I'm sure, I'm sure there was cocaine involved. No, she involved. said they were dark. You can either be dark or you can be light. light yeah. And if you're dark, then the spirit can come into you AKA uh, whenever you want and take control of your body. Sound like so a walker. you have to kill the body. That's what they said. So she said that she, they, her 16-year-old was dark. And her 11-year-old was dark, J.J., which is Yo, crazy. Yeah, yeah, man. And it's like, and you, man. And you know what's so fucked up? So, J.J., J.J. not even, like, J.J. had, like, real grandparents. And they and they they missed them. And their grandparents is on the, uh, the grandparents the, the grandparents is the reason why they got caught. Because they like, man, where's J.J. at? Yeah. They're not showing they them where J.J. J.J. Not, yeah. Oh, God. So, like, that whole situation is sad, man. But it's, it's crazy kind of when you look at shit like this where it's like, why is this shit top news? But it's you, you know what I mean? Like think about that shit though. Like yeah. it's a lot of wild shit going on, but we're talking about that. I chose we you know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. but it's like that's crazy that this is what America likes to highlight. Where it's yeah. like, damn, but me personally, I feel like they ain't going for no Casey Anthony shit. They about to cook her ass. Yeah, I think they're right. finna cook her too. Who do you think you are? Definitely getting no cook, no cook chance. County. No chance. My- or to Chicago. Her and her husband, some sickos, bro. Yeah, they they real sick in the head, man. I was never in that church they was following or whatever, bro. But no, that's the that's thing. The she fell she fell in love with this dude who was a, a pastor and who was an author. In, yeah, he was an author, author of a cult, yeah. Yeah, of a, basically and fell in love with, with, with him. And the ideology and, of and, and, and that's what the shit. ideology was. Man. So it was his fault the whole it was time. That. That's why he's on, on there too. Dude has to be giving her like Crazy D, like that nigga has to be going crazy for her to do all that. It has to be more than just this nigga just preaching the word, like eating her ass, man. <laughs> yeah, <doing> something, <laughs> sucking toes, all type of shit. Man. He said that. He's Great going, face, the son's going crazy. Like he must like be like a Ron Jeremy or some shit because like how's you? How do you make somebody do that, yo? Eat their ass and oh. sucking their pussy at the man. same time. Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> How was doing it? <laughs> Who knows? But that's what he's doing, though. Yeah, Clearly, I, I, I think so. Because how how else can you explain it? I can't. No, this guy, can't. this shit is the shit. Don't make no sense at all whatsoever. That's why it's kind of. I don't hope police y'all need to pay me for my for solving this case. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. You need to be put on the payroll, bro. Shit, shit. That whole shit, shit is crazy, man. But like speaking of that, man, and all that shit, man. Did y'all watch uh any uh the news last week? Of the news? Yeah. I do not watch the news. Yeah, that's good. It's, it's bad for you. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> no, I ain't never watched it. Hey, see, I said it. Yeah, it's good. It, it's bad for you. Depressing. It's bad for you. But now, my nigga, uh, so y'all heard about China, you know, Russia yes. trying to drop the U.S. dollar. They trying to get on a cute. They trying to get like Cuba, man. Cuba did it a long time ago, you know, Fidel Castro and all that shit. You know what I mean? I don't think they got that juice, though. Y'all niggas not them. Y'all need us, nigga. Y'all need that U.S. dollar, nigga. That's, it's too much money of that shit. And let's be real. Let's be real. If it does happen, that shit would not affect, like, that shit not going to really, uh, it's going to take like 50, 70, maybe 100 years for that shit to really, it's too much money already out in the open. Y'all niggas can't just drop something that's already out in the open. That's like, that's in, who, who, who? I ain't going to. Who do you think you are? It's tough, it's tough. Lights, boy. Hey, that's what, that's what I was thinking too. Like it's been too much of it's a, a good idea, though. Of the money. I mean, it shows you recycle, China but. and Russia is powerful, and China and Russia together, 
Like that, this shit is scary as fuck. Uh, they've been know. against us for forever, nigga. Know, but, <laughs> but, 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 but they're really, but they're really clicking up in the public now and they been, really doing. They've been World War Two was that? Up in Navy in 2019, bro. This shit been happening. This shit, <laughs> but that's not a long time ago. Bro, that's four years. Four years ain't a long time. That's no. It's but, not, but 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 th- this goes deeper that's than that. This shit. This moment. shit is war, bro. They've been linked up since. You know since what I'm saying? Then. Since back then. And look at the last niggas that, that the, the Russians tried to link up with. They linked up with Japan. And that didn't work. Japan definitely immediately rocked on niggas at five in the morning, though. <laughs> Pearl, Har- right. Pearl Harbor right. Harbor was crazy. You know, they bombed them niggas at, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, you know, that was really us. We ain't going to get too deep in that. Long story short, you see what happened. Y'all niggas know we the only motherfuckers ever to use a nuke, right? Yeah. Only ones. Indubitably. Yeah. The shit deeper. I feel like this shit's a scare tactic. This is this is all that is. They're, they're showing niggas how much they really don't fuck with Biden by doing this shit. Mm-hmm. That, we don't fuck this Biden nigga, man. Right, y'all got him no, up out of here. No, because Biden, like, w- w- what we doing, we low-key in the shit. That nigga we in the shit. They Trump beefing with niggas. We beefing better. with niggas. <laughs> hey, they beefing with niggas. It's like, it's like you beefing with a nigga, and then I'm giving this nigga shit to help like, hurt you. Mm-hmm. Where it's like... <laughs> A nigga. Really? <laughs> really? I know I got he got it. that from you. <laughs> that, nigga, that nigga Trump said I could make all this shit better. And that's what and that's what's so wild because that shit, if he come and do that, right, it's gonna be a bigger war in this in the United States. Yeah. If he come back. All right, yeah, he yeah, might he, he, he might be able to put that political fire out. Yeah. That's but in the, me though. You're not hearing me. He might be he might be able to put that political fire out. But in the United States, the racial tension with him coming back, it's not gonna work, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fact. not gonna work, bro. That's fact. That nigga, come on, man. That nigga had niggas. Pull up to the Capitol and nothing happened. Well, should they kill one person? I'm surprised. Only one. Mm-hmm. That shit still going. All right, but yeah, man, that whole that whole thing is crazy, man. But like you being an old Navy guy and shit, what's your kind of take on on you know what I mean China and Russia? You know what I mean talking about dropping the U.S. dollar or dropping the U.S. dollar. I mean, for me personally, it don't do shit. But for everything and what's behind what they're trying to do with it, I think it's big. Because we don't know what the fuck they talking about in their war rooms, whatever you want to call it. Board means all that, bro. Big government, that's big to them. And if it's big to them, that means we're we're in the shit, no matter what. Oh, y'all trying to shut us out? Cool. Bet. We got y'all. In America, we some fucking bullies. Call a spade a spade. Uh, we're the biggest we're ones, man. That's yeah, why I personally... I, I, that's and why... These I, niggas yeah. is not going to take... Because China surpassed us in Russia for currency. They passed us now. So With our help. <laughs> type shit. You feel me? But now, <laughs> we made these niggas richer. <laughs> now we, we shot ourselves in the food. Sitting here like a fucking old school sitcom. Looking stupid as hell. And we got granddad. What, what, what's he going to do? This nigga don't even remember. He got a news conference. No, right. the, whole shit. Shit. <laughs> the, the, the whole, the whole, the whole, the whole, the whole shit. Biden, old as fuck, yeah. old as shit, man. Senile as fuck, senile as fuck. Look the like whole, his skin is peeling. Shout out the to whole, my profile pic. The show, the whole, the, the whole shit is crazy when you think about it in hindsight, man. Because like it's like, damn, what the fuck is about to happen next? You know what I mean? Like we going down, we seen conditions we never seen before. Fucking with this nigga, and I ain't just saying it's Biden fault. He just happens to be the nigga that's that. that that's nobody there. Like nigga Biden, that's there. Biden hey. said I'm finna die. Fuck you niggas. I don't give a fuck. What's hey going man, down? Biden gonna pull up and tell her to tell all the secrets, y'all. Like, all right. he said, my life is over. <laughs> nigga, that nigga really gonna say my life not yours, nigga. <laughs> fuck you, me, nigga. My life not yours. But no, that's just crazy. Just thinking about all that, man. It definitely is, though, bro. But man, no, going forward, man, uh, play yourself. This is me, man. Y'all, y- y'all, uh, I, I know y'all watch the show. Y'all niggas know I used to do the play yourself, man. But you know, I had to change it to why he do that, man. And uh, exclusively, you know, I had to change this last minute because I got some new information. You know, what I mean, from one of the uh, the great reporters here, Kev. You know, what I mean, he talk uh, your shit, nigga. gave me some information, and a nigga said, uh, you know, Malika Andrews, you know. Uh, had a situation with uh, Jaden Rose today. Where Jaden, my baby. Yeah, I guess you uh, like her. You like her? What? Yeah, let me. Get, yeah, nigga, uh, do I like her? Yeah, nigga, let me explain. Let me finish explaining yeah. it. So I guess like uh, she, uh, they reached in for a hug. They did some hug shit, and uh, she said, Jalen. She said, Jalen, uh, get your finger out my armpit, Jalen. Like on live television, she said that, and then you know what I mean. She was getting some backlash for it, and I gotta say, nah. 
Nah, she not. I'm not giving her no backlash. What's wrong with her telling Jalen to keep his? I'm giving. I'm giving Jay. I'm giving. It's played yourself time. I'm giving Jalen the motherfucking backlash. You know why, Jalen? You know why, Jalen? First off, nigga, why is your hairline that crispy, my nigga? <laughs> First off, like I just want to know, my nigga, why is it that crispy? Like I can honestly say, like I'm, I'm, I'm happy for you for that hairline. But you wild, my nigga. You you like you you literally like an old forty six year old nigga. You lip you really living like you in your prime right now, and that's kind of wild to me, my nigga. Like you were supposed to be looking like this when you was in the league when Kobe was dropping eighty one on your head, nigga. Ooh, but you, yeah, you out here doing that, and I say you a fool because when you messing with the Molly chick, when that's your girl, what if that's her friend? You know better. What's the first thing that niggas tell you when you when you when you got your first job? Who don't what they t- what they tell you when you got your first job? Don't they look say, at the women. They say keep they say eyes. they don't say keep your hands keep keep your hands to yourself. Stop touching niggas with your hands. Do you need to see it? Who do you think you are? It's tough, it's tough. Jalen Rose, you're a clown. Don't do that, bro. And Richard Jefferson, I saw you doing it too the other day because he booty bumped her. Facts. Oh yeah, well, that's a that. light skin Wait, shit. That's what I said. The nigga, the, the, the nigga. Ah, uh, yeah, I will show you the clip. The nigga Richard Jefferson booty bumped her. I saw it. You Trey. gotta relax. Like what you do as a kid? Like, like they was finished talking, and it wasn't like she did it. He did it. So I can see it. these niggas just doing that type of shit. Right. And she's already like that. Some motherfuckers don't like being touched. Right. You gotta respect that. I don't like people touching me. I'm gonna keep it a bug. Booty like, bumped her. You know what I'm saying? But it's like Jalen Rose, man. Played yourself, man. I'm gonna have my sound bite up next time. I had to uh, erase my shit. That's why it's blank. He booty Played bumped yourself, through. my nigga. I, I, yeah, I'm still on. He, he booty bumped. I feel, hey, we, gotta, <laughs> we gotta add Richard Jefferson yeah. to that shit too. Yeah, man. They no. both played themselves. You but, booty but, bumped. But her. I ain't gonna lie. Like you said, you said light skin nigga. So I just left it at that. Cause he's <laughs> he's the he's the type of light skin nigga. Like there's two there's there's different type of light skin niggas. In the universe, you okay. know what I'm saying? There's the Chris Browns, there's the Drakes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Richard Jefferson, the uh, Drake. He's honorable mentions for the week. That's <laughs> crazy. Yeah, that whole situation was crazy, though, man. <laughs> yeah. How the fuck you? <laughs> the whole situation you the dog, was crazy, motherfucker. That whole shit, man. That whole shit as well. All right, real quick, man. I got a shout out to one of my uh, local businesses, man. Honey Bee Spa, located on Grand 1317, man. Make sure y'all pull up there, man. Get you a nice little bubble bath, tea bath, all that shit, a facial, all that, man. A bubble it's bath? Gonna be, it's going to be a promo code. It's going to be a promo code up. We'll be able to, uh, you able to put it in. You'll be able to get a discount, you know what I mean? So if you're watching this shit, You'll be able to get, you know what I mean, a discount on all that. You know what I mean? You get a facial, a wax, all that for your girl. You know what I mean? Do it. Do it, do it fellas. Get that cash app ready, nigga. Do it. <laughs> Take your girl to Honeybee. All right, man. We back, y'all. We good. I got it. Bing bong. We good. We back, y'all. So, I've been watching the news. I know you haven't. <laughs> Y'all heard about that? Y'all, y'all heard about that uh, horse, that horse Fetty? Yeah, hey, you yes. new niggas is crazy, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. Y'all are in fucking sick. Yo. already doing Fetty. Yo. Let's mix it with yo. some horse drinks. Yo, so there's a new strain of fentanyl out. Can y'all niggas believe that? Like, no, who would want to fuck no. themselves even thought, but more? I thought you could die. These niggas is already. So the, the niggas that were surviving... They said, let's out the ante. All yeah. the, the, niggas they really call, are, the niggas that you call survivors, they're all right no, there listen. at that gas station. It, right there. Oh, Holiday yeah, on yeah, Pennsylvania. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, right there. In New Jack City. <laughs> they say you can never get too high. You can never get too high till you die. Never. They're on the highway to hell, man. Y'all, it's people dying. So y'all didn't die. So we're going to add in this horse tranquilizer, though. Like, bro, you know how many CCs that is? A lot. Bro, I watched y'all. Y'all see old school. They Remember shoot when, when Stifler gave it to Will Frank. Yeah. He thought it was some thousand CC. Them Bro. niggas, them niggas shoot bulls with that shit. Yeah. Elephants. Do you know how big nuts. a fucking bull is, my nigga? I'm a bull. Shit. Shut, shut the fuck shut up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> damn. So damn. So what? You gonna be on the Fetty? What are you talking about right now? I'm a bull. I've been caught a horse. I'm just saying, man. Shit. Listen. Bro, you, gotta relax, you gotta relax, I gotta bro. You gotta relax, bro. I gotta have that one. <laughs> Say no more. <laughs> hey, but no, don't. I don't want no tranquilizer though, man. I can't be tranquilized. 
Put that nigga on mute again, man. I think I might have to. We gotta relax. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta talk to you gotta relax, man. <laughs> no, but on a serious note, because you know I always got to get on here talking about political serious shit. Y'all should not oh, want to do you? that. Yeah. <laughs> y'all should not want to do that to yourselves, though. Like, just smoke some weed and drink if that's what you're going to do. Y'all putting fentanyl with the tranquilizers? If so y'all want to go to sleep and then You got to go high. I don't get these new high. niggas, man. Me neither, bro. Like, y'all want to go to sleep and then die? That's the new wave now? What's the shit hey. with the niggas be, uh, with the niggas? I be seeing uh, all you niggas at the club. You niggas be, uh... Niggas be pouring the honey in the Casamigos. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, the what the fuck? Yeah, what the fuck is, the fuck what the fuck is up with you freak boy ass yeah, niggas, niggas, man? Broken. You that's niggas some real parts. freakazoid. Y'all remember freak? Y'all know, y'all remember your yeah, niggas is freakazoids, bro. Freakazoid. Yeah, that's scary. Freakazoid. Like yo, freakazoid. Like new age Bill Cosby. Niggas. Y'all niggas dick don't work. Basically. I really don't get it. On my soul. Yeah, Do you right, think that honey really works? What? I'm never gonna try it. Heard it. I heard it. What the fuck? That ain't got nothing to do with me, man. Wait, wait, wait. What are you into, my nigga? I'm not into none of that shit. Don't do that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you into? That ain't got nothing to do with me. Just say, if, you, yeah. if you'll do honey, you'll do anything, thing. nigga. That's the moral of the story. To write, no. the the, the, the yeah. hypothesis is... If you do honey, you'll do anything, nigga. Yeah, that's wild. <laughs> but like, uh, let's, uh, Y'all some freaky bumps. <laughs> nigga, I think you the only one. You did it. We, did, we didn't do that shit. You, you, you did it. We didn't, how the fuck we did it? turn into bondage? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Talk about, I, I don't know. Yeah, the freaky bumps over there on the other couch. <laughs> well, what are you talking about? Well, well, I don't know about the bondage, but I know the honey is the hunt. So it was a wild thing. So hold on, hold on, hold on. Was it honey and hookah? <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think you are? Casamigos. I hookah at the crib yet. <laughs> Honey hookah it. and Casamigos, cuz. Hey, don't don't run me in with them hookah niggas either. <laughs> don't do that. Beat it, go ahead, nah. Real hey, niggas drink do down Julio. Hey, you'd rather don't be one of them. Real niggas drink down Julio. These niggas can fucking go to the club. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> Listen, man. I love you, man. Live your life. <laughs> I'm gonna do what the fuck hey, I want. You fuck we ain't gonna right. judge you, bro. You still part. You still part of the squad, man. I know. Still man. Game, I judge, man. It don't matter. It's cool. <laughs> but no, nah, man. This uh, is judge me free zone. Switching notes, man. This is something I actually forgot to talk about, man. But uh, it's off. It's not on the uh, joint. But uh, shout out to Jonathan Majors being clear, man. Talk that shit. Yeah, he got clear, man. Talk that shit. What you mean? So. Uh, about a week ago, two weeks ago, he got uh, a he got a, let, me, can, can, let me get it out, go brother. Ahead, ahead. He uh, got arrested for allegedly strangulation and some other shit, shit, some other sh- like mouth, of, a like, female, uh, yeah, of a female, of a female. But you know, of course, the first thing I asked myself when it happened was she white? I think we all did. Yeah, <laughs> when I found out if she was white. He was out of jail. Bingo. She lied about it. She made the whole thing up. He's out of jail. What city was this in? New York. It's in New York, yup. Everything was New on York. camera. Everything was recorded. on camera. It was recorded, yup. Everything was recorded. She, Every- he called the police for her. Yeah. So she to, lied. To make sure that she was good. Lied all and, that. In the state of New York, I read something. They said someone has to go to jail in a domestic situation. No matter what, someone's getting arrested. That's a fact almost in most states in the United States. I, yeah, I had no yeah. idea about that if that's true. That's why. That's a fact. Yeah, that, yeah. You call, it, you call the police. It's like you wasting money, nigga. Like, yeah, yeah that's like. stupid. So he. he <laughs> nigga, somebody's going to jail. He, he that's why bitches that play on the phone, that police shit, don't deal with them, brothers. Oh, my soul. He I said all the time. Went in and all you, I'm not going to call y'all coons, but y'all coons, wrote this man off all over the internet. I got on Twitter a I day know, later. I ain't no coon, but I ain't no coon, but I. I didn't write him off, but I did say, you just start getting new bitches. Why would you do this? I did assume that he did Oh, it. that's what y'all thought. I see you. Remember I when I said that? that. Oh, God. Because I'm like, he just started getting, why would you do this, my nigga? Like, you not like, you know what I mean? Like, this is, I pray, like, you know what I mean? You was like the regular nigga that you got to the top from from, 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 from grinding. Don't mess up now. That part. You got to, you, nigga, you have to dominate more fields. Nigga, I'm talking about, you know. You know. <laughs> Come on, Franklin. <laughs> okay, 
Ooh, he said Baskin Robbins, thirty one flavors. Basket, you know what I'm saying? Man, <laughs> get them all. Shit. Chocolate deluxe. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, chill. <laughs> oh, that brother, shit's crazy. No, nah, but that shit's scary as a black man. When you get to a certain level of success, you gotta worry about shit like that, man. You, bro, you have to, no matter what. And bro. this whole Me Too movement is just making women just want to throw false allegations, even if they get nothing out of it. The man still got to walk away with that stain on his jacket, even if he did nothing at all. Look at that false allegation Mark. that happened in the city. Yeah. Well, well, it wasn't false actually; it was real. But the, that it was real shady when the, when the girl put that list out. Yeah. Oh, I know. She yeah. put the list out of everybody's STD results. Yeah, yeah all that. Yeah, that, that, that you that little, wicked. you little niggas. Are there was like, a bunch of young motherfuckers on. I there. ain't gonna lie. It was a few. It was a few Charmanders on there, but it was. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You see what I did? Yeah. You see what I did there? Yeah. You see, what I did there? Yeah. You see what I did there? Yeah. It was a few Charmanders on there, but it was definitely some Charizards, my nigga. I swear. Ooh. I saw some big niggas on there. <laughs> yeah. What'd you say? What'd you say? Shame, shame, I know your name. Shame, I know your name. Yeah, man, that's crazy. Cool. That. Yeah, that, that whole trying to accuse a man for some shit like that got to stop, man. Whatever happened with that shit that happened with Michael Irvin, by the way? Yeah, the video that's came out. Question. Yeah. The video came out, bro. I, as soon as the video, full video came out, it seemed like they stopped talking about it. Right, so on, I'm, I'm guessing, yeah, I guess. Type shit. Even, though, know, even, though, even though, even though, let's be honest now. That Freak Nick uh, documentary is about to come out. Now, I feel like Michael Irvin can definitely be, be indicted. He definitely probably going to be in there. He definitely going to be in there. <laughs> he definitely finna be in there. Y'all seen Kanye ass? Yeah, Kanye was definitely front in there. Front row. With the camera. camera phone. That shit was fun. That shit oh. was, that was with like With the this. polo on. Chilling with the backpack. But yeah. Damn. Sure, that's yeah, gonna be ugly. Smooth. Man, would you be mad if your mom was on there, bro? I, bro, I don't know what I would I do. I don't think I'd be mad. I'd be hurt. Like, damn, I mom, this my mom was, and ass. This what you was living before I was here or while I was a baby? I'm finna post the results. Did you ask her? Hell yeah. I asked her last night when I told you I was. What'd she say? She said she wasn't. What do I look like? I said, you freak. I gotta know. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga's wild, bro. Who do you think you are? Hey, we yeah, gotta mom? use his shit. This is a sick Negro. Yeah, this is a sick Negro. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. Get help. I got, yeah, I, I got, I got to add both of those for sure. This is a sick Negro. Right? She might have been down there pimping some hoes, man. You just had to no, make sure. Gonna, listen, bro. Hey, no sure wrong, man. Face in there, dude. Switch your notes, man. Y'all like conspiracies? I'm kind of yes. one for the end, one for the autumn. How y'all feel about that Dwayne Haskins shit? I saw Ooh. you looking at... I, I, wiki, wiki, wiki. I saw wiki, you catching wiki. up on it, man. Yeah, that shit's wild. I was wild. catching up on it, too. How you feel about that shit, man? Like, because, like, yeah, like, yeah, like kind of going, because, yeah, you kind of been when on it, it. When it first happened, I said, I was thinking, like, bro, this is some... It's weird. The whole story, it seemed like some first 48 scripted shit. Yeah. First off, this nigga got drunk and walked onto a freeway. Y'all, I'm sure y'all been to Florida, yeah? You can't yeah. just walk on them freeways like that, bro. They're big as hell. Right. He just stumbles over the barricade, whatever may have you, and gets hit by a, a pickup truck or whatever. And now the ESPN alert I got the other day said his wife is taking all this shit to trial or court. And she's trying to sue everybody. everybody. Included, they said the driver was part of the, of the, 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 the shit. They said because he had enough room to avoid him. You know what I'm saying? That shit. That but shit's hey, gonna be deeper than I'm, anything, bro. I'm gonna keep it real though. It's reminding me of uh, that one. That one shit. That one dude that played in the NBA. Remember who whose hom homie's wife uh, shot him? I feel like I know what you're speaking. Homie's of. wife. Ho homie. He played in the NBA like 2009, 10. I think it happened like a little bit before that though. His wife. Uh, what was Buddy's name? Yeah, you know what I'm talking <laughs> yeah, about. His I wife. Like his wife. His wife paid niggas. His baby mom paid, not his wife, his baby mom paid niggas to kill this nigga. Damn. Mm. His, his name was Wright, something Wright. He played for, oh, Lorenzo Wright. Yeah, yeah Lorenzo Wright. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah Lorenzo Wright. He played, he played for the Grizzlies, yup. That nigga, Damn, bro. I never heard was, about that. Yeah, he was from Memphis, bro. I remember bro. that. Yeah, that shit was wild, bro. She, she, she's still in jail right now. She tried to, uh, hold on. She tried to get a pill. She tried to get an appeal for that shit. Didn't that shit make first forty eight or some shit? Or it, one of them documentaries? It could have. It probably. They definitely made documentary. I remember it was a documentary or something. Yeah, that shit wild, bro. That shit wild as fuck, man. That shit super crazy, man. That Haskins shit though, man. They said they said homie was drugged. Yeah, yeah. They said he, he was drugged. He got robbed ketamine. before the fact. How much of him money? Dying. How much money could they get what from the Wayne Haskins though? Like, did he just get a big contract? He he, he had a he had a nice ass watch on. They said they took the watch. Yeah. But to be honest though, I feel like I feel like that whole thing. 
he was probably with them, hanging out with them, getting fucked up with them. Like, motherfuckers probably just hang out and do drugs. Like, they rich that, as fuck. You know what I'm saying? So all of that ketamine and all of that shit, that? he was probably getting fucked up. You know what's what? crazy? He was he got, just at training got, earlier that day. He got lined up. Niggas yeah. lined him up. Mm-hmm. It sounded like a... Slipped him a special K. It, it low-key sound like a situation. I mean, I don't know. I don't want to just jump on it, but it could. It sounded like one of them situations. Like, imagine Aaron Hernandez, if we, he would have got smoked by one of them niggas he was hanging with. Right. Aaron Hernandez, he's out here doing be, wild shit. Yeah, it, it could be like a reverse thing with that, where it's could like he rolling with some niggas, you know what I'm saying? Like, we don't know these niggas. But they slipped that nigga at Mickey, bro. They had, he had ketamine in the system. Yep. That ain't something you just casually take. Hell no. What the fuck? And his alcohol level was like a point two oh point two. It was like three times the legal limit. Drunk. I mean, yeah, I was gonna say though, though, that's not that's not that's not easy like, to get nobody, drunk. If you no, drunk like nobody that. was in disagreement to what you said about he that. Might have got fucked up in in, oh, in, in, in took some that, special. Oh, well, the way you said it, you responded oh, yeah, like I'm busy. Yeah, yeah, I didn't yeah. mean to say it like that, watch, yo. Watch your approach. <laughs> Who do you think you are? It's tough and stop. And he said, "Say no more." I heard it too. <laughs> oh All shit! All that shit's crazy, man. Did y'all uh... rest in peace to that man, though, man? Hope his right, family get justice, young. man. You think so? I mean, you think? Uh, what do you think is actually gonna happen? You think people are gonna actually get charged? Like, who's, I think the people who, who probably who, was around him gonna get charged, but but like, who, guy, like, who would you blame the most? The driver? The driver for one. If he if, if it was an empty highway and he had enough room room to move out the way and not hit him, then he got to be held accountable to a certain degree. That part. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And then the other four people, other than that, the business and the hotel and the other spots they stopped at, they you can't you can't blame them people for that. They, they really probably had no idea what was going on unless the people who was involved worked at them establishments. You know what I'm yeah, saying? That that can make sense then. But if they didn't, then I feel like she's just trying to construe some shit together bugs. and see where's what where the leads is gonna end up at. You know what I'm saying? We'll trying to connect the goes. dots on the investigation. Like he went here, here, we'll here, see. here, there. Another news, man. Y'all uh, see uh, that Mark Taylor shit? The uh, the trainer. He was riding around Atlanta. He was getting his. Uh, oh yeah, yo, yeah. yeah. man. That bro. video is. Wh- he. I'm gonna I'm 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 play some of it for them people. Yeah, that shit is wild. On and, uh, downtown Atlanta, staying here at the uh, Omni Hotel. Everybody seeing in. Sick. Ain't seen a white person in sight. <laughs> that nigga. Homeless ones on the street. Inside. He sounds disgusting. They can have it now. It used to be a fun place to come to up here. They can have this place right here. We took it, motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck you, me. Down the Marco. Marco. It was just a sign up there. Had Obama and all them on there. And stuff, man. So, yeah, it's all that's up here. Bro, in that video, he told somebody they can go hunting there. He literally said that. Yeah. He's, like, he's, I, t- I text bro. I was like, bro, is this, is, did he just say that? And he told, he said that he'll hang somebody by the, uh, by the uh, tree. The, by the tree. tree, right? Yeah, on God. The nigga, like, pointed, the nigga pointed at the tree. Yeah, like, I'm going to hang that off shit is this right he here. Dead ass. He said, he said, yeah, he come up, come up here and go hunting. I said, you know, bro, what? You know, you know, to me, if you're an NFL trainer, and like that's like your main job, and that's what you're known for. And that's what you do to feed your family. I don't think you want to be saying shit like that about yeah. about black people. Hell no. <laughs> the majority of your people is that you working with is black people. My nigga, when the last time you seen a white running back besides Christian McCaffrey? None. I don't remember. I don't. I've Peyton never Hillis. seen. I was just about to say Peyton Hillis. Hillis. I've <laughs> never seen a white cornerback in recent years. Who? He's got a very. I don't know the Eagles got one, but never mind. Yeah, he might. He must not be good. Fuck the Eagles. He plays for y'all. <laughs> uh, never mind. No <laughs> never mind. <laughs> no comment. <clears throat> but no, that's that's wicked. To, that it's twenty twenty three, bro. People still think like he says he could he would hang her. It's two thousand twenty three, bro. Oof. People still thinking like that. I mean, shit. When that shit in you, when that shit in you, it's in you, bro. I be thinking to myself all the time. Every time I see an old ass, old old ass white person, I'll be like, damn, how many more of y'all is left? Like, when's like the last old white person? You know what I'm saying? Before I start looking old, you know what I mean? Like, (laughs) it's got to be like a year where these niggas all just like, oh shit. 
But, so what did you just say? <laughs> yeah, when you look, when, <laughs> when you, nigga, the baby boomers have not died out yet. They the still fuck out there. Did that nigga just say? <laughs> <laughs> what you didn't hear me? I heard you. Nigga, so what you mean? You, so what do you mean? What did I say, nigga? Oh man, this nigga's out. <laughs> that weed, bro. Hey, mute, yeah, mute this nigga. I swear to God, mute like, this nigga what? Again. <laughs> nigga's about to get muted. He's in the box. Oh, shit. Penalty box. <laughs> ram, ram, ram. That nigga said all that to say nothing, nigga. <laughs> but no, that's that's fucked up, man. And, and you say he had NFL trainer. Yeah, they gotta hold him accountable if they ain't gonna. You gotta him, think, bro. Everybody his him, age, bro. everybody that looks like him his age, typically probably thinks like that. Yeah, that's, that's the baby. That's boomer their area. up. That's their upbringing. That's what I'm saying. Nice. You know what I mean? Like, when is the last one of them gonna be gone? And I feel like he the tried last to do one it. of them. I feel like they should get all them niggas out the league. To be honest, yeah. bro, I don't care about the prestige. But that thought process, that video alone, that bro, shows you, that bro. Shit is harmful this dude's a trainer. You don't bro, think owners? Is imagine, like that? imagine the locker Facts. room in the training facility right now. Yeah. I'm not coming to practice or to lift because yeah. they're get dude out of there. Oh, he you fired. He, I bet you he's fired by the morning. That could turn to some Donald Sterling might, shit. Uh, it better. Nah, 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 he ain't no owner. They but still, though, like, he ain't no owner. He ain't still get him up out of there. Nah, he gonna be gone quick. They gonna let him resign. They're not gonna fire him. They're gonna let him resign. They, yeah, they're gonna let him get his pension and shit or whatever retirement. He might because he's because it's fucked up because he's he's been there for a yeah, minute. Like yeah. dog's been there for a minute, minute. But I, I ain't gonna lie. Agree with that, but, but just I, get I, the I, I ain't gonna lie. There. I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't though. Right. Like I but wouldn't that shit like is wild because just like in this era, they're trying to the people that's not are the people that's secretly on that still, but not trying to show it. They're like, man, we can't have that. I'm still right. trying to make money off this shit. Mm-hmm. Some people see shit for what it is. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like right. being like you racist, you racist, but like being like. Being like 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 prejudice, where it's like if you a motherfucker that grew up, you ain't like black people, bro. And like that video was just him saying that. You know what I mean? It's version. like one of them things where I'm like, yeah, nigga, you was raised the wrong way. It's on you to want to change. I can't right. make you want to change. It's on you to want to change. But at the same time, that shit's in you regardless. So when you get mad at a black person, typically the first thing that come in your mind is gonna be some racist shit. That's just the facts of life, my nigga. Me personally, I think they should just get that shit out the way and just be like these niggers and just make a video. Get yourself out of there early. Ooh. Don't do all this stuff and then you want to. I some, see Jerry Jones almost lost his team yeah, over that shit. You want to do Wait. some underhand dork that? shit? You Wait. know what I'm saying? And all y'all think was nice. Nice. It was a it was an old picture. So like when uh when they started second oh, yeah, yeah, yeah when they started doing the segregation of shoes trying to uh, hold that girl back from yeah the and I ain't gonna lie man like 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 I be laughing at shit like I like my sense of humor I laugh at like shit that I shouldn't be laughing at but I laugh like in a different way like this motherfucker like that's that be my laugh that motherfucker got on there and said well shit you know I wasn't with the racist crowd I was just seeing what was going on I said. Mm. That was really? the illest. That was the illest spinoff. That's what I would have said. Like, man, I wasn't over there with them. I wasn't over there with them. I was just there. Like, I'm like, bro, you know, you was over there with them yeah. niggas. Right. He right there, like, posted up. They just they got though. they just ain't got you talking, nigga. Now, nigga, let that be a little uh uh, uh iPhone live picture yeah, yeah. where we push that motherfucker. What you was yeah, doing yeah, next, nigga? <laughs> that nigga was doing something next, nigga. What was you doing, he nigga? Been cooked. Yeah, man, I'm saying, bro, that's why I'm like, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. But uh, that money shit is different, man. You see, it took, uh, they all said uh, Donald Starlin was uh, was racist for oh, years. Yeah. Baron yeah. Davis was saying it when he played for the Clippers. Niggas right. don't even remember who <clears throat> playing for oh, the, the, the Donald Clippers. Sterling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, niggas remember that. Like, it, it, took, it, took, it took a chick to bring him down. Yeah. Shout out to her, man. And hey, I ain't gonna lie to you though. The funniest shit that nigga said I agree with. Hit <laughs> <laughs> this nigga go. The nigga, shit, no, bro. Oh, you, if you, hey, nigga. I fucked that. Everybody can say some real shit. Right. I think Donald Trump said some some real shit once. I'll, show, I'll tell you what that is. But no, the nigga said uh, Donald Sterling on He was like, well, why do you have to be with him? Right. He's talking about Magic Johnson. He was like, why do you have to be with my like at my games and hanging out with him doing all that? You know what he's got. <laughs> <laughs> what? Y'all didn't see that interview? Yeah, I no. seen it. You don't. All right, look. All right, look. All right, look. All right, look. look. That's the recorded conversation. And the interview quote. This is what he said. With Anderson Cooper, the nigga said, "Uh, yeah, Magic Johnson, big Magic Johnson." He was like, he was like, "What does he got?" And then Anderson Cooper's like, "He's an owner." You know, Anderson Cooper, try, you know, try to shit yeah, on him. He's like, he this and that, that and this and that, and that. That nigga said, <laughs> "He's got AIDS." He was like, he has HIV. He was like, oh. <laughs> You showed me that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, bro. Certain shit I feel, bro. He's racist. He's been racist. He should have been up before that. Right. But if I see a chick I'm messing with rolling around a nigga that 
has some shit. Right. How you gonna react? Bro, but uh, yeah, clearly, man, 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 clearly nothing happened yet because he clearly still wanted her. Because son said, "Why do you have to? You have to be with him at my games." <laughs> <laughs> I ain't hear yeah, that. He part, was hurt. She must he was hurt. No, 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 no. That shit. No, that shit's part of the. Uh, when, you know when she recorded. Yeah. She was playing that nigga. She was. Can you stop calling them that? What? That's what they are. Yeah. I don't care. That's weird. Like, he was out there. He ain't get no fuck. But they. But the, the thing is, they've been saying it. Niggas mm-hmm. just didn't care. If she was riding around with magic and doing shit with magic, <laughs> and and then he still wanted her, she must suck some good ass Dino. <laughs> <laughs> That's the gold, all I'm saying. Nigga. The, the golden mouth. Right. Yes. <laughs> oh, has, has, has to be. Head. The golden mouth. Has to say, be. Grab old dicks and was sucking. She's a bitch. She's a, bitch that's she's a baby stealer. <laughs> I agree a thousand percent. A thousand percent. Shit's dropping, man. Yeah, man, but like, it's with everything that's kind of been going on, man. The world's kind of been crazy, man. It's like, everything's racial, man. Everything. Oh, it always will be. It's never going to change. Everything, man. It's so bad, like, wrestling's getting racial, man. I see niggas being racist, man. The fucking, uh, shout out to the, you should have a video I told you last night, man. The, uh, yeah. The Dudley w- 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 boys are Back. The Dudley Boys came back right now uh, last night, right? I seen that. Yeah, man, I'm reading the comments, man. I don't. Real Dudley Boys, bro. Yeah, I, had to, I had to show this nigga bro. juice. I, I saw hey. a clip on Twitter. I'm like, what? They did every highlight move they got and they put did. the nigga through the table and put a nigga through the they table. Had a hammer. I mean, they had a table. Yes, yes. bro. I show you. I show you every highlight move they got. The one off the ropes. The Bubba Ray fucking hand shuffle. The oh, 3D. Devon, Devon, and Bubba Ray. Yeah, bro. It was fire too. He, he was like, bro, you see this? I was like, no, nigga. He thought it was at WrestleMania. No, it ain't one at WrestleMania, bro. Hey, that remote over there, bro, y'all? You got to put that shit on mute. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. But look, I say I have to say this. I'm reading the comments. I'm reading the comments. Y'all see it? You see it? Look, somebody got to look. I can't play the video, nigga. I know remote, cause he said niggas don't know remote. This niggas crazy. This nigga is hilarious, bro. You still gonna go look at it? All right, fuck it, fuck it. I'll show you niggas after. Another time. <laughs> Another time. <laughs> but yeah, man, I'm reading the comments and shit, and it's like little dickhead kids. Like, why is the white guy telling the black guy what to do? And I'm like, oh, here we go again. <laughs> DMX voice, my yes. nigga. Here we get, yeah, bro. Yeah, nigga, so reach a lot, my nigga. This is this is why kids need to be educated properly, especially when it comes to WWE. Because uh, it was never that with them two. That shit is wild. Them same kids as that was asking that don't know the APA. They they don't know what time Usher was in his drop top cruising the streets. (laughs) Wow. I nigga, I nigga been waiting to say that one. So so promo like a motherfucker. Feel that nigga though, man. I ain't even gonna lie to you, man. Hey, no, nah, another news, man. Y'all watched that trap right interview with uh he's talking about levels. Uh-uh. Yeah, no, I, ain't see, I, ain't I seen I seen I seen Revy. Shout out to Revy. Um Who the fuck I seen that? I seen her talking talking about that shit. Revy Revy. Uh, That's an artist. Revenue? Yeah, yeah, uh, Nimic. Nimic Nimic, Nimic? Re- yeah. yeah. I call it Revy. Nigga. Remember that one time when uh <laughs> yeah, yeah you were there you were there you were there I don't know what he finna you remember that I shit call her Revy, nah you remember that Revy. remember Revy. that remember that time when, when when we was backstage in the green room I do and you said that dumb shit what he say it's bro okay man Revy, man Revy, Revy, Revy man, my it's baby like, it's like three years ago nigga we this is what you know what I mean we still do the podcast shit yeah. <laughs> bro was just doing a pitch to get out of the podcast he like yeah. And then, yo, we fuck with you, nigga. Hey, we gotta get you on. We're gonna talk about that sexuality shit, all that shit, nigga. Oh, all man. that shit, yeah. Hey. Revy, my baby, man. Revy, my baby. 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 I love Revy. Do you remember how that night ended for you? I said that a oh, hundred times. Do you remember how that night ended? I do. That nigga, I, that nigga I brought, do. that nigga brought, uh, Hey, Smitty, he brought her to murder you, nigga. He brought her. She's giving head up. 
<laughs> he bought one of those. Grab on dicks and was sucking. He bought one of those. Who do you think you are? Listen, listen, man. It was a fun night, man. Revy's my <laughs> Revy's my baby, man. I love Revy. <laughs> Revy's my baby. You made the situation awkward, bro. Awkward is an understatement. Nah, Ruffy's my baby, man. Nah, we ain't talking about that no more. We on from that. You, st- he's still talking about the same shit. Uh, <laughs> of course, because I'm supposed to say no. <laughs> <laughs> we said we closing. <laughs> no, we not. No, no, we're not, nigga. I just said that. But no, nah, man. Let's uh, get back on the shit, man. We had a trap right interview, man. They was talking about the whole shit with the levels and shit. And the uh the whole law, I ain't know with some real law, law like law shit, like motherfuckers is trademarking. I was like, God damn, you niggas is really on some it's shit. It's between her and I, and I think some, a nigga named Buddha. Yeah, some nigga named Buddha. Buddha. Yeah, 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 yeah. That shit's crazy, man. I hope they resolve that. I hate seeing black people beef, man. So yeah, so they talking about the level showing them all of America. Is yeah, not it's her. not. Yeah, she said that. She said that months ago, like almost yeah. like yeah, like it's not a part of it. But like, I never, you know yeah, what I mean? Like, don't go there. Don't stop there. <laughs> yeah, but homie saying oh, that, you shit. know what I mean? Like yeah, he's saying that, like you know what I mean? It was his shit from the jump. She just tried to hijack it on some like, shit. You know? So it's one of those type of situations where it's like, damn. But the interview was dope, man. It was a fire interview, man. I, I appreciate it for what it was, man. But. uh the Minnesota drama continues, my nigga. I'm about to check that. It's like J-B. it's like Minnesota feed off drama, my nigga. Doom, doom, doom. And it's funny because like a nigga like that don't like drama. Like we don't like we like to have fun, right? My niggas, my niggas we're like supposed that to be fun. Minnesota yeah, nice. We nice. Out there say, we nice. drink and have fun, nigga. Yeah. Or happen and then slap a old. Or happen. Or happen. What he did. You know what I mean? Can you duck? Shout out Y'all to him. Go, can you duck? Because that's what it seems like it wants to be. Because all this drama that's going on in the Minnesota scene with the rappers, the little media shit, the blog pages. If y'all niggas ain't going to fight each other when y'all see each other, stop, stop sneak dissing. Because real yeah. niggas is getting tired of seeing it. I'm going to start Facts. tagging like, who you talking about? Who you talking about? Facts. Who you talking about? Facts. Because you, nigga, Facts. who you talking about? Facts. Niggas is. Preach. Niggas is. No, niggas is just different, bro. So all that shit kind of is a, is, is a mixture. Y'all see that shit? Niggas just be wanting attention and a clout, bro. And I'm surprised that shit's I saw a nigga trying on. to charge. Did you see that flyer? <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that flyer? It was. Oh, no, f- man, you got to pull that shit up. Uh, yeah, bro. I seen that flyer. Man, I can't even put, do, pull it up. I'm working. Who right do now. you think you are? Who do you think you are? It's tough, it's tough. Hey, you know what I. You, hey, hey, you know what this generation. You know what this ge- generation got, like, confused the most? That, that, that. I know my worth. I'm going to keep it a buck. But there'd be a lot of niggas that be worthless. No, I'm going to keep it a buck. Ninety-eight percent of you niggas never knew your worth. <laughs> I like how that niggas just did the math, bro. Right. Eighty-five percent of you niggas never will. A hundred of you niggas smell like dick. <laughs> so it's like the shit you niggas talk about. And the nigga, the shit, the niggas that say that type of shit is the niggas that buy everything through life. We come from the era where we got to play. We had to beat the levels to get the uh, to get the good costumes in the video Talk games, nigga. Yeah, nigga. God, we couldn't just buy them, nigga. We, we couldn't just buy them, nigga. We had to have a memory. We ain't have, nigga. We come from ha- not having memory cards, nigga. We had to keep the game on for eight hours and pray our mama didn't turn that shit off while we was at school, nigga. Literally. Do you know the type Dang of stress no. we had growing up, nigga? Right, Ooh. we live. We we lived a different type of life, nigga. Yeah, you appreciate. Yeah, used to have niggas nervous, bro. They we, don't know. We was trying no, to beat games don't. in one day. Nigga. We was trying to beat games in one day. You niggas is trying to get blue checks in one hour. Talking about you got it from grinding. No, you're trying to pay for motherfucking what? blue checks, nigga. Listen, <laughs> fifty dollars a month. And you know what the blue checks really for? A thousand fucking followers. It's really for so niggas don't make fake pages for you. That's what I was. That's it's what I was it's so niggas don't make identity shit. Don't nobody even want you niggas. Don't nobody even want your baby mamas, nigga. If don't nobody want your baby mamas, then what the fuck? Who nah, are you? Y'all, I'll be honest, man. A lot of y'all baby mamas, you know what I mean? They've been labeled hoes. My niggas told me they would go. They just told me that. And I don't know why. Bars, but it's just nigga. but it's just something that you just see in the city where it's like, why do y'all niggas knock women up and feel like it's yours? Possession is not real. It's not yours, it's my not, nigga. It's, it's not niggas. yours. It's not yours. It might be mine. It's not you niggas are sharing, bro. Like I it's said, it's like a three man, man weave, man. Like I said, on man law, if you did not marry that woman, let her do what the fuck she gonna do. A lot of Say y'all niggas man. be fucking y'all homies, uh, girls, man. and then y'all be in their face still. Oh man. god, that's weird to me. Where it's like, oh. where's the loyalty at? Like, there ain't nothing. I can't sit in front of my man's and do none of that. Like, wiggy, 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 you know wiggy, what I mean? Wiggy. Like, but you know, a lot of niggas still think with their man's. That's why them no, you know what they think with that honey. 
You niggas is taking too much of that motherfucking honey. That's the problem. I know what happened, bro. I know what happened. Them niggas start taking the honey and the purses. I ain't, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna say the H word. I'm not gonna say the H word. I'm not, I'm not, no, I'm not gonna say it. They, they expected that. I'm not gonna say it. He said it. I'm not gonna say it. I said it. I, he said it. I didn't say it. But you niggas, why do y'all wanna be like the girls? Look at the men fashion. Why? And I'm not, li- listen, listen, I'm not, listen, I'm not, I'm not homophobic. I, I don't give a fuck what you do as far as your sexuality. I'm talking about the masculine. Like, why can't men be masculine? Yeah, they don't want why to they, why they want to kill it? Why is the black man being masculine considered him being reckless or dangerous? Because or we reckless? are dangerous when we are together, bro. <sighs> when we on our masculine shit and we got our woman supporting our masculinity, we a dangerous force. When they divide that shit and they pit us against each other, we ain't advanced nowhere in the last 10 years because of that shit, bro. Man, we, we, man, we turn We're going backwards. Just, Super backwards. I don't bro. even say we going backwards. It's a new lane to backwards. We ain't even going back. I like that. We ain't new even going lane. back the same That's, backwards way as a new lane to back. It's losing. literally, it's literally like the shit we was talking about with the music. How poison this shit is. The yeah. shit, the shit y'all little niggas was listening to, and they try to well, niggas that try to defend it. Our age. Oh, we was listening to that shit too. No, we no, wasn't, bro. It wasn't, it wasn't no, that. we wasn't, bro. We wasn't thirteen was listening to. I just killed a nigga. Roll up. Nah, nigga. You couldn't even say shit like we that on the radio. Little bow wow, nigga. Could nigga. you even? You couldn't Chris even Brown. say. But think about this shit. The shit these little niggas say. You literally couldn't even say on the radio. Fact, it was bro. more R and B joints. You had to make a radio hit. That's why Fifty Cent went hard. You know what I mean? Get what you're not trying. The next one was pop. He yeah. did all commercial joints. Lil Wayne even had to do it on the Carter Three. Pop. You have to play by the game. Now the game is just fucking. There is no oh, game. Oh, it's streaming? Oh, we ain't got to worry about radio plays just streaming? Man, say what the fuck you niggas want to do. We don't give a fuck. Kill, 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 kill. Right. Drill, 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 drill. And if you an old nigga and you supporting that, eat a fucking dick. Because that type of shit is wild. You can still, you can still indulge in a culture without being ignorant like that, my nigga. Right, that part. Like that part of it, we don't need that, bro. I feel like this came apart. Get of drunk at a barbecue a, uh, and embarrass yourself, nigga. Don't fucking support drill. Fuck. The lost, <laughs> the lost, uh, uh, the lost art of artist development is what got it to where it's at now. They have no good PR. They have no artist development. Or oh, they got a following. They got some shit behind them. We just gonna push it. We niggas just, just jump on Instagram. Yeah. Jump on Instagram. They got the label behind them pushing it. They you got motherfuckers working their Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all that shit. Half them niggas not even good at it. That's yeah. why it's the dumbest shit. Like, yeah. you niggas need to, like, eh, eh, bro. So they get on there and self-incriminate themselves. Get on there and say all type of stupid look shit. Look at uh, all them artists that that nigga Gucci man signed in the last four years. Just they look at that in shit. Jail. They dead Half in them jail. niggas are in jail. Or, like you said, are dead. Yeah. Nigga. Nigga. He was supposed to be big homie to some fuck just giving him some money. Get him some real game. Look at that like shit, though. That look shit. at look at this shit. Me, personally, I said this shit on the podcast with Katie Got Benz. I said, yo, when I think about who first, the first person I remember dissing dead niggas in that way. In that way. It was Gucci. No, it was Gucci. Yeah, he, was said, Gucci. I, he said, dig your mans up on the, on the truth. Yeah. Shut your man, go dig your mans up. Yeah. Then, you know what I mean? He, he, he also has said, he's smoking on it. Well, I've heard him mention saying shit like that, but to the extent Chief Keefe and them Chicago niggas definitely made that popular. Yeah. But they was listening to Gucci. Yeah. They was listening to 50. They was listening to Walker. They was oh, listening niggas. to Walker. Facts. But oh, these little true. niggas just took it and they lived a different lifestyle out there. I say that to say this. You niggas in Minnesota, there ain't no fucking trenches here. Stop with that bullshit, nigga. This is a get money state, raise your family state, live your get life state. state Fuck are you niggas oh, talking God. about? Y'all niggas want this shit to be gangland. It's never gonna be gangland, nigga. Yeah, and yeah. if y'all want it to do, y'all corny because all y'all niggas gonna tell on each other anyway. Right. Then you'll go to jail <laughs> and get beat the fuck up every day until you switch sides in jail. Then you'll get right back out and switch sides. This is the cycle of bitch ass in Minnesota with a lot of you niggas. That's the cycle. You need a siren sound right there. Nigga. You need a cycle, nigga. You niggas gotta relax with that sucker shit. Cause they be on Facebook and yeah. Acting like yeah. real that. Like Acting like you like street. Like really Listen, I know civilians that'll fuck you up. On my soul. <laughs> fuck you talking about. Minnesota should be play- Minnesota should be player city. The niggas nigga. that get money will fuck you up. Not the niggas that's out Preach. here be uh out here doing this. Like y'all niggas doing the wrong shit. This ain't the nineties. And these niggas be fucking chicken littles, little bird chest little niggas out here doing this that's, shit. That's what throws me off. Niggas is built like little kids. <laughs> no, yeah. Yeah. Built like a child. Who like, you what talking the, to? Nigga never did a push up in his life, bro. Never did a push niggas, up in his you, life. If you go to jail, nigga, niggas is gonna fucking execute you, nigga. And but that's they, the thing. Niggas be thinking just because it's Minnesota ain't jail. Listen, jail mm-hmm. is jail. I heard about niggas in Oak and uh, Oak, Park. Oak Parks getting yeah. their shit took it. On my soul. I heard niggas is going in there willingly. 
Oh yeah, niggas definitely is having consensual you, sex you, in there. Niggas is definitely bitch? doing that. You go in that bitch. Niggas is person? wild. Niggas hey. is wild. Bro, I heard niggas going there. You don't know your lick. Oh yeah, come here. That shit's definitely a thing, man. No, yeah. oh, no, all that all shit. shit. No, all you don't that, know no, your no, politics, man. anything. You going there? You kind, oh. you kind of got to. All that yeah. shit is a dangerous game, man. If people, you don't know your people politics, don't play it they well. taking your ass down in that bitch, bro. And as you should, because that's the game. That's why I said the post. What I say? I said welcome to Minnesota, where uh, you could wake up. Join a gang without no background check, no affiliation, no application. Niggas don't even no get jumped in no more. That's what I'm talking niggas to Cole. That's, that's, what, I'm, that's what it is, an application, a yeah, background right. check. You ain't getting put on, nigga. Come that's on, why it's just it, it's different here because half the, I, listen, man, I know niggas here that gang bang, and I don't know why they gang bang because I'd be like, you can't even defend yourself. If I wanted to harm you, you couldn't do nothing. Bro, I made it 35 years without joining the gang, nigga. I made it, I made, I made it where I'm at too, man. You know what I'm saying? Talk Mm-hmm. I got my affiliations and shit, but that don't mean shit. I'm a man first. <laughs> you know, I can say shit. I was crip. <laughs> <laughs> I was crip, cuz. Don't put me in the atmosphere. Hey, I, I was just saying, man. Just chilling, bro. <laughs> yeah. I didn't say shit. You on the podcast, nigga. Fuck you talking about you chilling. Man. Oh, here we go. Yeah, nigga, here. What nigga, that last do? summer knocking you down, Juice? That's what I'm saying. You hear this, nigga? Pause, yeah, pause, 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 pause. <laughs> knocking you down, dragon nigga. Knock, yeah, knock dragon, nigga. He said knocking you down. Pause, pause, pause. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Hell no. I yeah, just man. Be chilling. Uh, yeah, man. It's I been like a. Uh, yeah, man. It's been fun, man. It's, it's been fun. So, uh, what y'all got planned for the the weekend? This weekend, yeah. Well, if it fucking snows, nigga, I'm inside like a bear. It's snowing on John Sunday. Got me fucked up with that. Bro, That's crazy. Be beautiful as fuck. Tomorrow again. Friday supposed to be, you know, middies. Saturday rain. Okay, I can live with some rain. I and saw it's you. You want to snow? Walking in the rain. Minnesota, chill out. <laughs> you believe in control didn't weather? Take fucking pills is what happened. Do y'all bro. believe in control weather? A weather control? Yeah, they control. It. Absolutely. I feel like to a certain degree. To a certain degree they do, yeah. Yeah, to a certain degree. They can't, like, stop, like. Because last year around this time, it was still cold as fuck. Talk that shit. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm I'm actually out in this bitch, and I'm like, what the fuck? 84? This day last year, it was Weaky. like 10, 20 degrees outside. With a little bit of snow. It wasn't a lot of snow, but it was a little bit of snow, but it was frosty in the bitch. It was glow It water. was enough to still Millie Rock on any block, though. Yeah, you know what I mean? That's, that's all that matters, you know what I mean? For all my niggas out there that was, you know what I mean, that had to grind... I had to catch the 16 across the town to get some, uh, you know what I mean, some poom poom. Man, you know shout I mean? out. Shout out to you niggas, man, because you Word niggas made to it. 62? You know what I mean, 62. We come, 16, we come 62, from, yeah, 16, yeah, 16, yeah, North yeah, 16, 16, 16, 16, yeah, yeah, <laughs> facts, facts, yeah, right, yeah, facts, facts. All that shit is legendary, man. Y'all shit, y'all niggas, uh, y'all know what I miss, man? Be like, we know how we was kids and shit. Like, remember, like, when we was, like, used to be shorties and we were, like, sending, like, a sub out? You ever, like, send, like, a sub on, like, Facebook and shit, like, back in the day when it was popping and, like, all it, all your shorties would like eat it up and text you at the same time. Life was good. <laughs> my nigga, my nigga, like, no, nah, like, nigga, the achievement of that, like, niggas used to really be like, my nigga, I made it. Like, nigga, <laughs> like life was good. Like, my nigga, like, like, yes, like, you know, my mom, home, mom always told me I had a gift in life. Like, niggas used to talk to themselves. <laughs> like, when, when, when niggas first got that first, you know what I mean, that first action from girls, niggas used to really. It was like a good feeling. Like y'all niggas don't understand. Like y'all niggas know, but if you don't know, you little niggas don't because y'all don't value women at all. Boom. We used don't. to really we 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 it, see with us we we knew the bitches, the women, and the hoes. We knew oh, the yeah. difference. Y'all niggas just treat them all the same. That part. And honestly, even when we call them the women, the bitches, and the hoes, we don't actually say that to them, nigga. Just we just categorize them, them and we know how they, they listen. We 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 see we observed how they like to interact. We right. see how they like to be treated. Jimmy, I'm trying to put some money in your pocket. Say it again. That's it, man. That's it. Oh my mama. But no, man. No, it's been a dope episode, man. Uh, we use the GoPro. We will have the other one next time for this episode. So you know, we just uh, trying something different, man. But uh, hey, can I give a shout out to OT Genesis? Yeah, go ahead. Doing this thing at the Go Room. And uh, pulling up to our booth and, and tapping in with the homies, and um, I'm mad I wasn't here. Man, I know, <laughs> I know. You know, we was on some crip shit. What's that have to do with it? But uh, right, right. Shout what out to the event that we threw at the spot. <laughs> what event did we do? Never giving this nigga the light, bro. You can't yeah, give him the light, bro. He, see, oh, the the, the moon bounce, yeah, the moon the bounce, yeah, the man. Moon bounce, bro. Shout, shout out, out to the moon yeah, bounce. Shout out to the moon bounce too. 
Sky the, the, the moon bounce was crazy, and we're gonna be doing an it event once a month. Shout out to Soul Two Dots. Uh, yeah, y'all gotta tap into them events. Crazy. You was in Dallas. I wish you would have came. I would have been there, but you was in Dallas. But yeah, it was beautiful though. It, it was definitely great decent. Turnout. It was awesome, and we yeah, it's gonna get bigger and bigger. So definitely. I got a bone to pick real quick. You said, yeah, we was on some crib shit. Don't bang on me, nigga. <laughs> don't you ever bang on me, my nigga. Bad, I be around bad, everything, man. nigga. I was at the crib party, nigga. Don't, don't ever bang on me. Hey, you, nigga, I'm a civilian at attacks, my nigga. Hey. Hey. Relax. Hey. Facts. Hey. You, and I fuck you know with all the hey. niggas you be around, but I know yeah. I, I know I know I'm not I know I'll knock out a couple of a lot of them niggas. I had Wayne in Hood Day. He was the only nigga that was there that was not. That was not from 60s, man. I'm not. For, for I'm, a, sure. I'm just a civilian. I was yeah, about to say, I ain't never got that right. invite either, so, bro. Yes, you, yes, you're right. For sure, for sure. But nah, man, shout out to all that, man. You know what I mean? What you got to say, man? What's going on? What's going on with you, brother, man? Man, I'm just going to these doctor's appointments trying to get healthy, baby. Then what happened, nigga? They got you? She got you? I got No! 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 Juice! Wah, wah, wah. Juice! This is a sick Negro right I don't know what he's talking about. He said you're a child talker, I got bit by a shark. He said he got bit by a dragon knight. A dragon knight? He wins. He wins. Hey, I'm done. Hey, I'm done. Hey, hey, y'all up. Hey. Hey, this, hey, this, this, is, this is episode, this is episode 80, man. We out, man. <laughs>